Some did feel like that. And it's kind of mixed reaction about Riley's Lincoln Riley's announcement. Some just aren't worried about what OU is doing and others think that this might be good news for OSU. It was a big win for OSU this Saturday, beating the Sooners for the first time in years. The glory was only short lived because 24 hours later, OU took over the headlines. Uh, I think it's more funny. It's almost like we ran them out of town. I think the timing was definitely uh, really close as far as when that announcement came and uh, um, yeah, just it being the, the day after that game, I think it was kind of uncool on Lincoln's part to wait till he should have waited till after the bowl game, I think, to announce that. For OSU student Maxwell Merritt, he thinks this may work out for his team. I think it's good news. I think it'll help OSU recruiting as far as in-state and uh, Texas recruits. To other fans, they aren't wasting their time thinking about the Sooners. I don't care what OU does. Like, I'm a diehard OSU fan. I mainly, I care what they do. Like, I'm not worried about what they do down there. And even though a new head coach hasn't been announced, some fans have their speculations. Right now you hear Brent Venables from Clemson is going to be the guy. And uh, he's done, he's had a lot of success at Clemson. And I think he's probably going to bring a new energy and a new physicality that hasn't been seen in OU in a long time. And again, OU has not announced the new head coach, but it's definitely an announcement everyone is waiting for.